since Yahoo Chief Executive Marisa Mayer unveiled a handful of new products, including a competitor to Google's predictive search technology for smartphones. Uh, this, of course, in a debut appearance at CES 2014. Irvin Fernandez and Krishna Kumar with that story. Join me in welcoming Marissa Meyer. Yahoo is keen to make 2014 the year of its comeback. Making a debut appearance at the Las Vegas Consumer Electronics Show, Yahoo top boss Marissa Mayer introduced a slew of new applications in a bid to regain the top slot on the web. Marissa announced Yahoo's acquisition of Aviate, a company that makes applications that automatically brings up user-relevant data, much like Google now. Mayer said a new smartphone application will be rolled out under the Yahoo banner later this year in a bid to boost its mobile subscriber base. What if your phone suggested music and map apps when you got into your car? Or fitness apps when you got to the gym or went for a run? Aviate does just that, automatically organizing your apps based on contextual clues, bringing you what you need when you need it. And she wasn't done just yet. Mayer listed Yahoo's plans to launch a personalized new digest for technology and food, again emphasizing its media-centric and mobile focus. Yahoo Digital Magazine will be anchored by category tastemakers, visually driven storytelling, and an engaging accordion style layout. Ever since taking the top post at Yahoo, Mayer has been aggressively pushing to change Yahoo's business module, and her strategy has already started paying off. For the first time, Yahoo's mobile subscriber base has crossed 400 million. Coupled with an aggressive acquisition strategy, the year 2014 could well be the comeback year for the once king of internet. With Irvin Fernandez, Krishna Kumar, ET Now, Mumbai.